Welcome to the last video on Bolt, the Bucket of Bolts. It's been a pretty interesting series. I hope so anyway. Uh, starting from literally a bucket of bolts and getting to the finished product, which we're going to call test engine number three because we've got heaps of imagination here. Um, I've taken the rocker cover off Bob because there's, I've been asked a question. The, the engine has no oil pressure light. The bike has no oil pressure light. How do we know if we have oil pressure? And this is a really good question. It's, it's, um, it's a solid question. Uh, my first answer to that would be, is your engine a seized, steaming, smoking ruin? If the answer to that is no, then the chances are you still have oil pressure. Your oil pump is working. Um, what I'm going to show you here is just how to see if your oil pump is working, how to check it out. Um, more useful for something like Bob here where it is... Um, it really, it's a rebuild, it should work, everything went together fairly well, uh, there was no real challenges, um, so it should be working, and the oil pump was dismantled and checked. So, I don't know, if you ever find this useful, that's great. Um, at the end of the day, they roller engines, I have to point out, they, they are actually quite resistant to low oil pressure you'll find that if you drain the oil out of your engine just for a joke one day and then rev, its daylight, rev it the daylights out of it um, you'll actually find that it will take a full five minutes to seize up um, but <laughs> who wants to do that? Who's that silly? Anyway, what I've done, I've taken the rocket cover off uh, you'd have to take the air pipe off as well which is that silver pipe on top of the rocket cover and I've taken the spark plug out so the engine spins over easier. And what we're going to do is just spin her over. Now this is Bob completely unstarted. So Bob has never been started. I've literally just put oil in it. Let's just see what happens. Now you don't want to run your starter motor for too long or else you'll end up cooking it. Just bursts. What we're actually doing here is letting the engine prime up. Okay, clever cookies will see the oil coming out there. Shall we do it again? So we can see that the engine does have oil pressure. Winding a, a fresh engine over like that is not a particularly harmful thing either. Um, when this motor does fire up, uh, we've just primed the oil system. So it's not run at 1300 revs dry so this is not a harmful thing in my opinion but that's how you tell if your oil pumps working one more time just to be sure make sure you're watching there. And you can see the oil coming out all right let's put this thing back together again and kick it in the guts